The drugs and hospital equipment donated are part of interventions aimed at ensuring the socio-economic well-being of indigents in the affected communities ravaged by insurgency and other clashes. Deputy Governor Martins Babale, who felt delighted with the kind gesture exhibited by the national oil industry, said government will employ every mechanism to ensure that the drugs and hospital equipment are fairly distributed to the communities. He thanked the donor agencies for their concern on the well-being of the IDPs, whom he observed have passed through untold hardship. On behalf of the government, I express it before that we are happy with the uh, NNPC and Stalin Oil for coming to our aid at this particular time. These are uh, medical equipment, drugs and other things to assist immediate affected areas. You know, we've been having criminal crashes, scanty around, apart from the Boko Haram effect and so on and so forth. These drugs can be used to assist. State Commissioner of Health, Dr. Fatih Atiku, said her ministry has taken custody of items donated and assigned the Logistic and Coordinating Central Management Unit to take charge of the distribution to affected areas. She assured that the items donated will be fairly distributed to the targeted beneficiaries in line with the prospect of the donors. Central Medical Stores already has um, a logistic management coordinating unit in place, so they have the um, tools that they use in um, trying to track you know, facilities because we're not just going to be sending these drugs to the communities, we're actually going to be sending them to the facilities close to the communities where these people live in. So uh, logistic management coordinating unit will be coordinating all that. They're all pharmacists here and um, they know how to do the supply chain business. So they will, work, they will coordinate it properly and make sure that the drugs get to the desired um, populace. Representatives of the Nigerian National Petroleum Corporation, Ahmed Abdullahi and Stalin Oil Company, Dr. Jabal, said the intervention program are part of their organization's social responsibility to complement government effort in impacting positively on the lives of IDPs and ensure that peace and normalcy is achieved in the affected places. We are looking at the IDP, I mean, internally displaced persons in the IDP camps, and uh, this is one of our intervention programs as directed by uh, NMPC top management, that we should be able to do something for the displaced persons. So this is just the beginning of better things to come. We also have sustainable projects with our partners, generally, you know, within the international oil companies that operate in Nigeria. This is a corporate social responsibility which uh, every company should follow. And uh, this is what we are doing it uh, as a joint venture along with NNPC. And they also had this that we should be donating something to the people in Adamawa as well as Borno State. And finally, we landed up with the drugs, which are the most essential things. So, this is what we had in mind. No, 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 no